I'm vegan because it's the right thing to do. I can live a happy, healthy life without any kind of animal product in my diet. I don't need to use animal products in any facet of my life to live a good life. And I think it's my duty to be vegan. I'm vegan because I think every animal is entitled to live its life free from harm, pain and suffering. So it just seems inherently wrong to take another's life purely for pleasure. I'm vegan because I don't want to pay someone to do these horrific things to these poor innocent animals, you know. They are put on this earth and then they are forced into slavery, they are forcibly impregnated, they are put up against horrible conditions and then they are killed for what, our taste buds? That's just not a reason to me anymore. The animal industry, entertainment, clothing, cosmetics, food, all of it, it's not justifiable anymore. You can't wear fur because it looks good. You can't eat a steak because your taste buds like it. We need to choose compassion and we need to open our eyes and our hearts to the truth of what happens to all animals in any animal industry and we need to feel love for them because, and we need to be a voice for them because they don't have one and I would hate it if this sort of stuff was happening to me. Why am I vegan? I went vegan 48 years ago at eight years of age after my father took me to Goulburn Slaughterhouse with my pet lamb and had it slaughtered in front of me. I could never eat meat following that. I'm vegan because I don't believe that we need to torture and abuse and murder other living beings to live our lives. I'm vegan because it's the only thing that makes sense in terms of our planet and the environment, economically, ethically, there is no argument anymore for why meat should be consumed by human beings. So the message I want to spread is that it's healthier and uh, it's certainly a more compassionate way for humans uh, to live. I'm vegan because I learnt a number of years ago that unfortunately there is no way to consume commercial animal products without contributing to horrific animal cruelty. Then I looked into the nutrition side of things because I thought, you know what, you probably can't get enough nutrients from a vegan diet. But once I looked into it, I realised not only can you get everything you need, but you can absolutely thrive and in fact you can be healthier on a vegan diet than on an omnivorous diet if you do it pro properly, if you plan it well and you research the foods. So not only can I be healthier on a vegan diet, but I don't contribute to paying for commercial animal abuse and it's also much better for the environment because of the destruction that the animal agriculture industry has on the environment. I'm vegan because I found out about these injustices and I wanted to do everything that I could to stop it and that's also why I'm an activist so that I can directly speak up for them. Oh, initially I went vegan for the animals and, um, and I love it, I love being vegan. It's a great community, I've got lots of friends in the vegan community. Now it's also about the environment, a little bit about my health, but you know, I feel great as a vegan anyway, so I'm not worried about my health, but it's really the animals that, that I do it for. I was um, a slow vegan, I was a pescatarian for three, two years and I was vegetarian for about seven years and, and after moving to Canberra and getting to know a lot of people in the vegan community, um, they kind of like um, educated me and um, it was always for the welfare of the animals but now since, um, since becoming vegan and becoming a nurse I've learned a lot about nutrition and also I've learned a lot about um, um, the welfare of the planet and know that um, the continuation of um, harvesting it for want of a better word of all these animals for food is has serves no benefit at all to anybody. I'm vegan because uh, speciesism, the same way that racism or homophobia or any other um, ism um, has permeated our culture and with the way we treat animals, it's just horrific and it's hidden away. And once you learn that information or find out uh, the way that we treat our non-human compatriots, I don't think you can not be vegan at a bare minimum. I don't want to participate in any cruelty to animals. Um, I don't believe that they're here for us. Uh, just, um, I believe that we can be alongside them. So the capacity that we have to 
be cruel to them and to use them for our needs, we also have the capacity to shepherd and be um, companions for them. Like. <laughs>